Hey guys, what is up? Welcome to another Black Ops commentary. Today, I want to talk to you about PAX. Um, PAX was basically the most recent thing that has happened. It was from August 26th to the 28th. No, I did not go. I'm just going to be talking about some of the things that I heard about PAX and, well, majorly Minecraft. Uh, Minecraft 1.8 was there. Notch basically explained everything that was going to be added in the new upcoming updates for minecraft now he did he mentioned was 1.8 this whole 1.8 update with all the npcs new terrain updates um is gonna be split into two parts it's gonna be 1.8 and 1.9 to make it more convenient um, someone says oh it could be 1.8 1.8.5 or something like that no notch is gonna go 8 1.8 and then 1.9 now with the new updates he hasn't specifically said what's going to come first or what's going to come last he all he was showing at pax was um the new npcs npc villages um he was showing creative and survival mode how uh they're different he was also showing how there's ravines there's caverns yeah that was kind of really what he showed there's a bunch of videos on youtube that uh, do show all this um all the updates for PAX. This was a PAX East 2011. So if you want to search on YouTube, you want to see some videos about maybe certain um, coverages or stuff like that, then there um, obviously will be a bunch of videos. Um, like Machinima must have been there. IG um, must have been there. Like a whole bunch of all these companies that uh, do videos and stuff like that had to have been there. Um, like I said, I wasn't there. So obviously I can't say everything that did happen. So I'm just trying to say what i know my biggest update would be the minecraft yeah they he not showed a lot of stuff there and it was just mind-blowing that all like what they've done all the skills all the new abilities like the dashing um you can do critical hits like if you not showed if you jump and attack at the same time you get like sparkles and with those sparkles you get like it, it, it well it's considered a critical hit and that was kind of cool they're they're obviously evolving minecraft more um to me i would like minecraft because now there's a creative and a survival it'd be cool if the survival part kind of went an rpg type of style um that's why like obviously if you look at some of my the mods from yogbox they, they kind of go towards a rpg role-playing type of game with the more animals millionaire npc villages and the actual rpg single player mod but that's obviously mods that's not in the real game you actually have to download them install them it might kind of take away from the original minecraft because obviously not just the original creator um if he wants something in the game he's going to implement it his way like the pistons the pistons were a cool idea like i tried them out and they were cool but when Notch added them, he completely changed it. Like, he added the sticky pistons. The original pistons didn't have that. Or they did, they just updated later. I, I don't know. But the, the sticky pistons and the normal pistons, also, the pistons can't launch you like original piston mod did. Obviously, whatever Notch wants to do in the game, obviously, he's going to do it. That's like kind of like what my major PAX update was, was minecraft 1.8 that was like the big thing that i saw that was i don't know most on the internet and um um the only the only good news that i heard about modern warfare 3 and i don't know if it was from pax or if it's from the upcoming cod xp but there's gonna be a 32 player match is this right like a 16 on 16 game mode now i don't know if this is for pc if this is on if this is gonna be on consoles there has to be servers because I know for a fact I can't even host a solid game battles on my internet connection. If I was to go into this 32 match player game and I get host, I know a lot of people are going to be leaving um, just because of my connection. Or everyone's going to be lagging, blah blah blah, they're going to be whining and I'm going to get all the kills. Like I don't care if I'm getting kills, but sadly my connection for some reason can't hold everyone they just like leave no one joins it's weird that's that 32 32 has to be a server if it's not a server then you're just gonna have problems if it's on a pc pcs automatically have servers i believe and that's obviously that's possible 32 32 that's that's possible also um i'm pretty sure battlefield 3 has 32 players i think i think i'm not certain but 
yeah they're gonna i think they're gonna have servers as well but uh i'm hoping next week uh my next video um uh, will all be well will mostly be cod xp uh, i'm pretty sure it's this weekend it's like the first i think it's the first week of september so yeah the cod xp in la is going to be september 2nd and 3rd so it's going to be like a two-day event um uh, there's going to be like they, they announced kanye west is going to be there also um i was following twitter and JD2020 is going to do a paintball 1v1 against White Boy 7th Street. So that's going to be, uh, I think that's going to be pretty funny. Um, I'm hoping they get like some GoPro camera footage from that. Um, but I'll, if I do see that video, by the time that I do upload my next commentary, I will put those links in the description below. And I will put this uh, Cut XP link in the description below if none of you know about it. Um, but the main, one big main thing is we're going to have like a, a, a tournament. And this has probably been going on, like the tournament kind of getting the, the people involved for a couple weeks now. There's been probably many events for different locations and all, it's all going to come down on this day. It's, it's probably going to be a two-day event. So you're going to see a lot of uh, maybe hopefully a live HD broadcast. No, like pay, you know, you got to get a subscription. I'm hoping they don't do that. But uh, yeah, Cod XP um, is going to be this week. It's going to be uh, this uh, Friday and Saturday, so uh, stick stick tuned to that. But uh, I guess my next commentary will talk about more and what happened during this uh, COD XP weekend. But uh, I hope you enjoyed this commentary. I'm DJ Parsing 9 and I'm out. Peace.